welcome to the Pink Streets. If you're not familiar with this area of Pinellas County, we are in South Pinellas County, about 10 minutes from downtown, and we are really, really close to the water, but we happen to not be in a flood zone, which is, of course, really important in Florida. Coming through, you saw the beautiful front porch area where you can put a nice set of table and chairs. The entryway opens up right into the living room, so you've got a lot of space here, beautiful furniture that they have in here right now. Uh, it gives you a great view of what you can do with the space. This is an enclosed Florida room. It does have a split AC system, which is great. You can close it off and keep it nice and cool or turn the AC off if you're not using the space. So you can envision a nice outdoor set of furniture here, open up the windows on the cooler nights and really enjoy this. This is a great place for an extra little table and chairs, kind of a cafe set. Coming in this way, we've got the kitchen, which has been beautifully updated with quartz countertops, stainless steel appliances, and nice solid wood cabinetry. There's a cute little cut through window so you can easily access the outside space there. And of course, there's the nice backyard out back, lushly landscaped, uh, and some bonus space off to the right. Uh, where you can let some dogs run if you happen to have furry friends. This is a dining room, naturally, which leads into the two-car garage outside. And the space is great being right off of the kitchen um, and also kind of separate from your main living areas. These are the two guest bedrooms on the swing of the house. This is a nice little bonus feature to close off this side. Linen closet here. And the smaller of the two guest bedrooms faces the backyard, so you get a really pretty view. It feels like a tropical garden out the windows. Updated plantation style closet doors there. All the windows in the home have been updated, and there is a brand new roof. Now coming in here, you've got the guest bedroom, bathroom, excuse me, um, with a really nice countertop, newer vanity cabinets, and some of the vintage style tile in there. This is the larger of the two guest bedrooms. Again, you get a nice view out the window, greenery. This house feels very, very private. So even out through the windows while you have homes all around you, it just feels like its own little oasis. Now there's terrazzo floors here. They're throughout the home. Some people love terrazzo. They've tiled over that in some of the areas. Coming back. Over here, we'll take you back to the master bedroom. We've got a nice little sitting area here. This is a perfect place for a desk. If you work from home, it's a nice office space here. Uh, this is a skylight. There are three skylights in the home, which help to really open up the house and make it feel light and bright. Of course, that helps with your bills, so you don't have to have lights on all the time. And here's the master bedroom. Nice size bedroom with plenty of space for large furniture, king size bed, big armoire, uh, any type of additional bookcases or things that you might have. This comes around to the master bathroom. We've got master closet here, a sink and vanity here, and then a separate shower stall, toilet, and additional sink back through. And again, there's vintage tile in the master bathroom as well. And again, we get these great views out the windows in every single room of the house. Uh, so you can really enjoy all the lush landscaping that the sellers have spent many, many hours perfecting and pruning for you. So coming back around, this is the house. It's listed at 459. Um, tons of space here down in the pink streets famous neighborhood that we, we all love, very close to the beaches, close to downtown St. Pete, close to waterfront parks you can drop in kayaks um, or even drop in a boat not too far from here. So we love this area, we love the home, and we're happy to answer any questions you have. Thanks.